The faculty has gained recognition nationally and internationally, and of course this has been achieved through its academic offerings within the arts and the humanities. Our mainstream include a Bachelor in Arts, Bachelor of Theology, as well as a Bachelor in Library and Information Studies. We also have offerings at postgraduate level, at honours, masters and PhDs. I think our unique context and ethos is reflected uh, in our commitment to diversity. And of course, one could say we service the beehive of cultures. We receive students across the spectrum in terms of cultural diversity. At undergraduate level, we are excited to present a well-coordinated, well-designed curriculum, which is intended to support and develop what we call critical thinking skills to students. Hello, my name is Sunny Bok and I am the Deputy Dean of Teaching and Learning in the Faculty of Arts and Humanities at the University of the Western Cape. And following on from Prof Khala Khala, I would like to say that both he and I are proud graduates of UWC. So, to elaborate on our academic offerings, we offer three degrees, a Bachelor of Arts, a Bachelor of Theology, and a Bachelor of Library and Information Studies. The Bachelor of Arts, or our BA, offers a number of different programs. Some focus on language and communication, such as Afrikaans, African languages, such as Kosa, English, French, German, Arabic, and linguistics. Other programs explore the social sciences and humanities, for example, sociology, anthropology, history, philosophy, geography and tourism, and women and gender studies. Students often ask me, what can you do with an arts and humanities degree? And I always answer that this degree gives you a platform for life, a base from which you can develop a range of different careers. This is because a BA develops what we call generic or foundational skills that are important in different careers. These include things like critical thinking, problem solving, good communication and research skills, as well as an understanding of how societies work, why things go wrong, and how we can build a better society in a rapidly transforming world. What would our world be without the community workers, the leaders, the social commentators and the artists who express in so many different ways the issues we confront as a society and help us imagine a different world. Our second degree, the Bachelor of Theology, is primarily for those who wish to qualify for the Christian ministry of any denomination. The UWC theological training is deeply rooted in the South African and African context and addresses issues such as HIV AIDS, poverty, gender equality, and environmental sustainability. It also introduces students to other world religions and to the moral issues that confront churches today. I would like to add that programs in Islamic studies are offered at postgraduate level as well. So our third degree, the Bachelor in Library and Information Studies, provides a professional qualification for a career with a wide variety of library and information services. In this degree, you will, you will learn important 21st century skills, such as how to collect, store, organize, manage, retrieve, and use information with the aim of creating and sharing new knowledge within organizations, communities, and in society as a whole. I would like to add that all these degrees are offered at both undergraduate and postgraduate level. And I should also like to stress that our focus on research is as important as our focus on teaching and learning. For example, our faculty has four research centers, which are all engaged in exciting, cutting edge work in interdisciplinary areas relating to the humanities, spirituality, multilingualism, and diversity. So what follows now in our presentation is a selection of testimonies by current and former students in our faculty 
describing how their degrees have helped them become the people they are today. We play these out with a beautiful guitar piece by one of our artists in residence, Reza Korta, performing his arrangement of Stravinsky's Rites of Spring. We hope you enjoy the rest of the presentation. Thank you. My name is Zuko Sikafungana, a film and theater maker anthropology PhD student at UWC. I came to UWC in 2013 and enrolled in the arts faculty. Because of my interest in film and theater making, in my undergraduate degree, I majored in English, psychology, and anthropology. The arts faculty offers a variety of modules from which, with the help of subject advisors, I was able to choose a combination that perfectly suited my need, leading me to the career path of my choice. In completion of my first degree, um, to further develop myself as an artist and as a scholar, I pursued anthropology, as along the years I have discovered it to be a perfect lens through which I can understand or rather study film and theater. I would recommend UWC to you because for me, it was and still is a perfect space um, for becoming and finding myself. I am proudly UWC. Hi everyone, my name is Nobandu, Soloshe is my last name. I am currently a postgrad student of the University of the Western Cape. I have recently graduated the year 2019, bachelor's degree BTH in theology, majoring in theological studies and ethics. I am one of the very few female ministers of religion, a qualified minister. I have chosen UWC as an institution because it is a well-known and recognized university worldwide that has produced a number of meaningful professionals across all departments you can think of. The benefits of studying at UWC are, one, I am a disciplined being. I came to the university very immature with what I have learned throughout the years is to be a disciplined being, mentally and academically. I am an independent being in terms of skill, meaning that I have acquired at the university has made me to be confident, credible, competent in the outside world. As I have been recently invited for gender-based violence deaths, for talks and also delivered sermons on UWFM as well as Bay TV Channel 260. What I've gained is independence, meaning I am employable, I'm successful in my career as a church minister, a leader that is able to talk sense and lead congregation in confidence. Choosing to study at the UWC is the best choice one has ever made. Um, as the degree will speak for you even in your absence. I am proud to be a UWC student. I have always been and I will always will be. I thank you. Hi, I'm Wasi Matthews. I'm a BA graduate from the University of the Western Cape. My undergraduate degree uh, consisted of modules from the Language and Communication Department, English, French, as well as Sociology and Anthropology, and I also did Humanities. I believe that my undergraduate career really gave me the skills necessary for the work that I do today. During my years of study, I was also fortunate to study abroad as a foreign exchange student. And I do believe that the university, especially the arts faculty, has many of these opportunities for students who work hard enough and get um, reasonably rewarded therefore. Um, the work that I do requires me to engage with uh, members of the public and to work very actively with the processes of legislation, especially in the Western Cape. The studies that I did at UWC equipped me with skills such as critical thinking, uh, sound reasoning, good interpersonal and intercultural communication skills, as well as strong research skills. And it's also during my time at UWC, I tutored a lot across different departments and lectured. So I know for a fact that a lot of my former students and even my peers um, are involved in careers, successful careers in the media, such as journalists, top journalists for leading uh, news agencies, television and radio personalities, as well as researchers who work both in the public and the private sector. Beyond that, you can go into things such as public relations. There are so many students that I've, that I've taught in the past and some of my, my peers who are teaching all around the world. Um, the main thing about this is, is that the skills you develop from a BA degree, coupled with your motivation 
and your your goals to really push yourself to the limit, equip you to work in an environment that requires these skills, especially in today's age. So from me to you, I strongly urge you to do a BA, a BA degree and really push yourself to the limit. And uh, I am proud to be a graduate. I'm UWC. Thank you. Hello. My name is Lee Porterfield, previously Lee Scamalo. I am an alumnus of UWC. I graduated with my bachelor's in linguistics in 2003 and then pursued and completed my honors in 2004. I moved to America in 2005 and within months I actually started working at the University of Oklahoma as an English second language um, teacher. So I was teaching foreign students and using my linguistics degree in that capacity. In 2006, I enrolled as a master's student in speech pathology and I graduated in 2009. Um, since then, I've been practicing as a clinician in America and have moved back about a year and a half ago, moved back and live in Durban now, where um, I am currently teaching at UKZN. I will be teaching uh, clinical phonetics and linguistics this semester, a class which I taught last year this time as well. Uh, I'm also looking forward to um, receiving my HPCSA registration in the coming months so that I can get back to practicing as a clinician in my home country. I'm, I'm so excited about the prospect of doing it and I Hello everyone, my name is Kadisha and I'm a former UWC student. I went to Pinance High School where I had the most incredible English teacher that inspired me to read more and study literature. I'd always wanted to study English and pursue a career in publishing and digital media. I decided to enroll in UWC and do my Bachelor of Arts degree where I majored in English and Language and Communication Studies. I love the program so much that I decided to do my honours, thereafter I decided to pursue my masters in English. After that I did an internship at Owl Magazine South Africa and thereafter I worked at Associated Media Publishing where I worked on amazing brands like Cosmopolitan South Africa and Marie Claire South Africa. Unfortunately due to COVID the company liquidated and three of my colleagues and I decided to start our own business and we started our very own digital agency. I would highly recommend UWC to anybody and to any student if you're looking for university that embraces diversity if you're looking for quality education um, you're not going to find better lecturers than at uwc um, my my course really prepared me for my career it taught me discipline and there are many skills that i learned in my time there that i still use today in my career and i am proudly uwc